Good morning everyone. Today's assembly is about Geography Awareness Week. Hopefully by the end of this assembly you will know a little bit more about what's so great about geography as a subject and why it's such an important subject to study. Good morning Croxley Danes. My name is Miriam and I'm currently training to become a geography teacher. When I studied geography at school, Mrs Cox was actually my teacher. Good morning Croxley Danes. My name's Kirsty Turner and I'm currently a graduate planner at um, sitting within the London planning team at a property and real estate company called Savills. Good morning Croxley Danes. My name is John McLaverty and I am the youth campaigner for Oxfam GB. I studied geography up to A level at school where it was one of my favourite subjects. Good morning Croxley Danes. My name is Dr Susie Grant and I'm a marine biogeographer at the British Antarctic Survey in Cambridge. I study marine ecosystems and habitats and I've been lucky enough to visit Antarctica on several research expeditions. I studied geography at A level and then I did a degree in marine biology at St Andrews University and my background in geography has always been really useful. My work involves understanding why different habitats are located where they are where animals go in the ocean and making a lot of maps that help us understand how best to protect marine life. My name is Abigail, I'm nine years old and I go to Little Queen School. Good morning Croxy Danes, my name is Daniel Sandbrook. I am currently uh, doing a Masters at the University of Birmingham in River Management and I also study Geography at the University of Birmingham, graduating this year. Good morning Croxy Dales, my name is Alison Straw and I'm an engineer and surveyor at Skanska. I studied surveying and mapping science at Newcastle University. Hi Croxley Danes, my name is Sophie and I'm project officer at the Gatsby Foundation. I studied geography at Royal Holloway University of London. My name is Imogen. My mum is Mrs Cox. I am six years old. I go to Malvern Way School. Good morning Croxley Danes. My name is Monica Stephen and I work for organisations that focus on poverty reduction and crisis response around the world. Some of you may have heard of some of the organisations I've worked for while listening to the news. For example, I worked with the United Nations and Oxfam in Pakistan, and then later for Save the Children in Syria and Lebanon. Hello, Croxley Danes. My name is Isabel Mitchell and I am a professional advisor at UNICEF UK, which is a children's charity. I studied geography at the University of Sheffield and at the University of Cambridge. Hello Croxley Danes, my name's Hannah and I am an environmental educator. I'm currently managing an education service for a water utilities company, so basically helping young people to connect with the natural environment and understand why water as a natural resource is really important to everybody on our planet. Good morning Croxley Danes, my name is Dan Raven Ellison, I'm a gorilla geographer. Gorilla geography is radical, alternative, creative, extraordinary geographies that surprise people in different ways and it's all about thinking about how we can use geography to better understand places and to make places better and to challenge other people to make places better in one way or another. Um, I'm a freelance geographer, which means I work for myself and I work on a range of projects. So um, seven years ago, I started a campaign that led to London becoming the world's first national park city. And then during lockdown, um, I got started a project where I recruited 700 people to help create a network of uh, 7,000 routes that connect all of the UK's towns and cities that you can use to walk from one place to another um, by foot using existing footpaths. Uh, my favourite aspect about geography is that it's broad um, and that it encompasses both um, kind of the social and the natural sciences. Although I thought all aspects of geography were fantastic, I particularly enjoyed the human geography topics. So my favourite aspect about geography is how diverse the subject is. Um, you know, geography is about people and place and there are so many different subcategories in between that, that there is something for everyone. My favourite part of geography is maps. I love geography because it puts a spotlight on relationships and particularly how physical features of a place impact people. 
and how people impact the place. My favourite thing about geography is that you get to learn about the human world and the natural world and how those two worlds interconnect. My favourite aspect of geography is geomatics, which is the science of mapping the earth. Surveying is the science of measuring and mapping. As a surveyor, I use the latest technology, like this total station, to measure angles and distances to determine locations on the ground. One great thing about my job is being able to work outside. My favourite aspect of geography is the opportunity to study and travel. I was lucky enough to undertake fieldwork in Spain and Malawi during my degree, and it was these experiences that made my degree even more memorable. What I really liked about geography was being able to go out into the countryside or to the seashore and really understand how the landscape had been formed. So I really enjoyed physical geography. My favourite part of geography is how you learn about so many different cultures around the world. And I think my favourite aspect of geography actually is I just love exploring. I love getting outside. I love meeting people, seeing places, thinking about those places. But I also really enjoy something called psychogeography, which the way I like to describe that is that it's the geographies of how you feel about places, um, how places feel about you and interventions or actions you can take, which will make you feel or think differently about those places um, as a result. And one of my favourite aspects of geography is the connection or the link between what happens in our natural environment and what happens on the human side of everything that kind of goes on in our world. So my favourite aspect of geography is getting to see parts of the world like Antarctica that I would never have had the chance to visit otherwise and all the fascinating maps that are part of my work. I think geography is vitally important because we are facing an environmental crisis and I think geographers are the people that can solve that crisis because we understand how um, people and the environment are inextricably linked and how um, locally and globally we are all connected. So I think understanding your place in the world and how everything connects will help us to create a world which is more socially just and environmentally sustainable. I think geography is important because it helps us to understand the world around us and highlighting the important link between the social and natural sciences, which is, which is crucial for us to understand um, in order for us as a society to move forward and develop in a sustainable manner. There are so many transferable skills you learn in geography that you don't realise can be transferred not only to other disciplines or other careers, but to your day to day life. So every to me, every day in studying geography is different. You may go from um, analysing one set of data to reading and analysing maps to writing a report. You know, there's such a different breadth of tasks that you could be doing. Um, based on different subjects, based on different countries or um, whatever. You could, be, you could be studying anything and you don't realise that those things you can apply elsewhere, even to different subjects. Even today in my job, geography is really important because I do a lot of work on the climate emergency. I do a lot of work on food and water. And it's really important, I think, for me to, to understand how human beings and the environment interact and geography is incredibly helpful for that. Essentially helping people to feel safe relies on understanding human and physical geography and that's why it's so important. I think geography is important because you are learning about our world. I think geography is important because when building, when building new infrastructure like highways and railways or new buildings we need to know where things should be built. As an engineering surveyor, I provide the known positions on the ground to allow construction to begin and continue through the life cycle. Geography is important because it's so much more than looking at maps and remembering capital cities. Geography encompasses environments, history, economics, politics, people and so much more. By studying geography, you develop rich skills, knowledge and understanding that will support you with your career in the future. I think geography is super important because it helps us to learn about 
other people and the way that they live both in the UK and in all different parts of the world and also to address the different challenges that we're facing like inequality and climate change. I think geography is important because you need to know how different people do different things and we need to understand that some people aren't as lucky as us here in England. I think geography is really important because it shows us how we're all connected to the world around us and it helps us understand what we can do to protect our environment. I think geography is a really important subject because it helps bring together all of the things that are going on around us in our world and it helps us to understand those things better, whether it's the social side of things, so the arts, the culture, the music, whether it's the um, economic side of things, what's going on with the, the global economy or local economies, um, whether it's political or social, it helps bring all of those things together and get a broad understanding of what is happening in the world around us. I think geography is really important for a number of reasons. You know, we face a number of crises in the world at the moment. We know we do. There's a health crisis with COVID. There's the ecological crisis where one of the world's 8 billion species are at risk of extinction. 70% of wildlife in the world has been lost in the last 50 years. We're in the middle of a, a climate emergency, a climate crisis, which threatens many species around the world and actually the nature of civilization itself. So fairly significant challenge. We have a social crisis in many ways as well, with increasing numbers of communities in various different ways um, becoming fragmented or isolated, something that in some ways has been made better by COVID, but in some ways has become more uh, pronounced as well. So we face these range of challenges and actually geography, geography is the binding subject that through place and through our understanding of space and connection and interdependence and interconnection and the way that people feel and think and act towards each other in other places. It is geography that is best placed to help us tackle many of these issues. And it does this because it can dive both deep into the sciences, looking at um, ice cores and pollen that's in there from that very granular perspective, right up to thinking about international patterns of global trade and how those two things connect to what people are buying from Tesco and the impact that then has on Asiatic cheetahs uh, that no longer exist in the Middle East. So geography connects all these things, um, but we need to see those connections. We need to have that understanding if we're going to tackle some of those big issues. But I think it's also important in our own personal lives because at the end of the day, for me, geography is about understanding places, but it's about making places too. And that can be as simple as thinking about how you can make your bedroom or your garden um, a better place for you to live. And that is still geography as well. And that is still very important to us on a, on a personal level. So I can't say any more really. Geography is absolutely awesome. I'm fanatically in love with geography. Um, and if you're thinking about tackling any of those big issues, then I'd encourage you to look at geography courses and think about taking geography on into the future. Good to meet you. Good to connect. Thanks. Bye.